Vadim Prostaiko is the 13th Minister of Foreign Affairs of Ukraine. He is 49 and was born in Kilia, a town in the Odessa region. He is married and has two children. He graduated from the Kyiv Polytechnic Institute and received a master's degree from the Ukrainian Academy of Foreign Trade. Vadim Prostaiko's diplomatic career is tightly wound with the North Atlantic Alliance. There is nothing in the documents that would prohibit us becoming a member of NATO even tomorrow. Since 2017, he has been the head of the Ukrainian mission to NATO. We have to achieve Ukraine's survival in a military conflict with Russia. This is the main task of the Ukrainian mission to NATO. We have to help our army become stronger through reforms and weapon supplies. Vadim Prostaiko started his diplomatic career in 2000 as a consul of Ukraine in Sydney, Australia. Later, he was a consultant to the presidential administration on issues of foreign policy and was a temporary chargé d'affaires in Canada. When Viktor Yanukovych was president, he was ambassador to Canada from 2012 to 2014. Except in the three Baltic states, if you look at our neighbors, all of which have left the same country 21 years ago, Ukraine right now is showing the best results. From 2014 to 2017, Vadim Prostaiko was Deputy Minister of Foreign Affairs. This is one of his last meetings in the Normandy format. He makes a prediction, and he's right. We are expecting some progress in the prisoner exchange process. It is a very painful issue for all of us. By the end of the year, 70 Ukrainians were freed from Russian captivity. So far, it is the last big prisoner exchange. Reported by Yulia Bushkov for UATV.